Hi guys, um, I'm back to do a trying to conceive tag. Um, I recorded this like three or four months ago and for some reason I thought it uploaded and it didn't. So, um, so yeah, you, my face brightened up. I have my computer right if you see me looking down. Um, I got this from Maddie B. Um, I have been watching her for the last couple months. Um, she's seriously like one of the nicest person. So I'll leave her link down below if you want to check her out. Um, so let's get started. What's your name? My name's Felicia. How old are you? I am 22, going to be 23 in October. What's your marital status? I'm married. Um, what is your significant other's name and how old are they? Um, his name is Zach. He is 26. How long have you been trying to conceive TTCing? Um, we've actively been trying to conceive for six months. What number child will this be for you? Number one. Um, what medical issues, if any, do you have that might affect trying to conceive? Um, I think because I was on the Depo shot for so long that um, they say it takes a while for your body to get used to not being on Depo shot. Um, I was on it for four and a half, four or four and a half years. I don't particularly remember when my last shot was. Um, are you on any medications or treatments for infertility? No. Do you use OPKs? If yes, how many do you keep in stock at all times? If no, go on to 10. Um... I did order some and I used them for like two months and I just, I know what day I ovulate. It's just, I don't buy them anymore only because I kind of get a little OCD about it. So, um, I just, there's no point for me to get them anymore. I know what day I ovulate and all that kind of stuff. Um... Are you crazy about taking a pregnancy test? That I am a little bit. Um, I guess when I take it, I like look at it like really. I have like, oh, is there a second line or whatever. Oh, sorry, there is a basket. Um, I am going to a country concert this weekend, so trying to pack my clothes. Um, okay. How many tests do you really have in the cabinet? I don't have any, only because I will continually take them. It's bad. It's a habit. It's something. I just want to be pregnant. Um, how many times a day do you test? Um, I don't have any tests, so that don't really apply. But usually, um, if I have a pregnancy test, I test for my first one a year and then my second one a year. And um, and then my OPKs, I take, um, like two a day, like one in the afternoon and then one at like five, but I don't buy the, the OPKs anymore. What is the earliest CBO you tested? Um, I think I was 13. Do you live? on YouTube watching do you live oh can't read um do you live on YouTube watching sorry I I was just in complete silence sorry I thought I heard something outside uh do you live on YouTube watching live pregnancy tests for the DPL you are um Sometimes, but that's like on a rare occasion. Has your significant other threatened to hide all tests in the house if you don't stop bugging them to look at the pee stick, trying to convincing them there's a second line? 
Um, no, because he wants me, me to be pregnant as much as I do, so, um, uh, if he's, like, home, because he works a lot, and I take the test, and he's up, he kind of, like, glances over at it to look at it, but other than that, or, like, because I'll leave him on the bathroom sink, um, he'll sometimes, like, um, oh, is that positive or is it negative or something like that? Um, do you wait until your mysteries start taking tests? Um, yeah, I really do only because I wait until like two days after my expected period because sometimes mine like fluctuate. Does everyone in your family and friends know you're trying to conceive? Um, yeah. Do you want a boy or a girl? Um, I don't, it doesn't really matter to me. I would love a boy. I would be so happy with a boy. With a girl, I'd be so happy too. Um, my mom wants me to have a girl because my sister's about to have a boy, so, um, and my sister wants me to have a girl because she didn't have a boy, so, um, it doesn't really matter. I have a niece and a nephew, so, I had much spoiling my nephew that I did my niece, so it really doesn't matter to me. How long will you try before you break or give up? Um, I don't think, I, I'm not sure, to be honest. Um, I did go to the doctor and I had my hormones checked. Um, they said that that was fine and I updated that in my last video. Um, is your significant other on the same page as you as trying to conceive? Yes. Um, we've been married for over a year, so we are steadily trying, trying, trying. Um, only because this is kind of like, now I can close my computer, but now you can't see my face. Um, we've... Since I got off the Depo shot in 2011, nope, it was 2012, um, we, I didn't, this is kind of a confusing thing, I got off the Depo shot in 2012, the beginning of 2012, so in... After that, they gave me a medicine, like, um, a birth control to kickstart my period. Well, that was fine. It kicks, it didn't start though. Um, so they gave me Provera and that kickstarted it, but there was no stopping. So I took the Provera in June. So then they gave me a progesterone pill. Um, and that, sorry, my computer died and I want you to see my face. Um, they gave me Provera in June and then they gave me the progesterone pill, I think late July, early August. Not really sure. I'm just kind of guessing here. Um, and so I stopped taking pills first part of September of 2012 so from then until now so for like a year and a half I think there was no like protection or anything no birth control none of that but um the last eight months um we've been actively trying to have a baby so I just kind of did this video in case some people come across my channel and are like what is your story and all that um I will leave down below some of the girls that I watch um I watch a ton of people I watch people from people that do makeup people who just do daily vlogs people moms out there like I love the mommy channels um 
one of my favorites. Um, what is your name? I can't remember her name. Um, Erin. She has two two boys. Um, I don't. I'm sorry, Erin. I don't know why your name didn't cross my. I was thinking Emily. I not sure, but um, sorry if I use um a lot. I it's just a word that I don't even. I know what I want to say, but it just doesn't come out. Um, but she has two boys, and she's documented both of her pregnancies, and she also had a miscarriage. So, um, also, I want to say that this is just a documentary for myself, only because I want to see where, how long it took me to have one baby, because I want to have three. Um, me and my husband decided that recently that we want three kids. Um, doesn't matter the sex, I really don't care. I could have all three girls or all three boys. It doesn't matter. Um, I'm crazy for saying this. I know a lot of people are going to be like, you're going to regret that. But I want twins. Um, and my grandpa's, my mom's dad, they have twins in their family. Um... My grandpa's brother and sister, Jack and Jill, are twins. And Jack's daughter just got pregnant with twins. So they definitely run in our family. So um, if I don't have twins, it's no big deal. Like, it, I just, it's just something that I would like. But, um,. I think that's all I wanted to talk about today. So, um, if you have any questions or suggestions or just want to talk, I'll leave my Twitter down below, um, and my Facebook. But, um, thank you for watching and I will catch you in my next video. Thanks. Bye.